Top 42 SAS and less interview questions and answers for fresh and experienced candidates. 1. Explain what is SAS, how it can be used. SAS stands for Syntactically Awesome Style Sheets and was created by Hampton Catlin. It is an extension of CSS3, adding nested rules, mixins, variables, selector inheritance, etc. SAS can be used in three ways as a command line tool as a standalone Ruby module as a plugin for any rack-enabled framework. 2. List out the key features for SAS. Key features for SAS include full CSS3 compatible language extensions such as nesting, variables, and mixins many useful functions for manipulating colors and other values advanced features like control directives for libraries well formatted customizable output. 3. List out the data types that SAS script supports. SAS script supports seven main data types numbers, e.g., 1, 5, 10, px, strings of text, g, foo, bar, etc. Colors blue, number 04A3F9, booleans true or false, nulls, e.g., null, list of values, separated by space or commas, g, 1.5M, Arial, Helvetica, etc. Maps from one value to another, g, key 1, value 1, key 2. Value 2 for explain how to define a variable in SAS. Variables in SAS begin with a dollar sign and variable assignment is done with a colon smiley face. 5. Explain what is the difference between SAS and SCSS. The difference between SAS and SCSS is that SAS is a CSS preprocessor with syntax advancements and an extension of CSS3. SAS has two syntax. The first syntax is SCSS and it uses the SCSS extension. The other syntax is indented syntax or just SAS and it uses the SAS extension while SAS has loose syntax with white space and no semicolons. The SCSS resembles more to CSS. Any CSS valid document can be converted to SAS by simply changing the extension from CSS to SCSS. 6. What selector nesting in SAS is used for? In SAS, selector nesting offers a way for style sheet authors to compute long selectors by nesting shorter selectors within each other. 7. Explain what is add extend function used for in SAS. In SAS, the add extend directive provides a simple way to allow a selector to inherit the styles of another one. It aims at providing a way for a selector A to extend the styles from a selector B. When doing so, the selector A will be added to selector B so they both share the same declarations. Add extend prevents code bloat by grouping selectors that share the same style into one rule. A. Explain what is the use of the add IMPORT function in SAS. The add IMPORT function in SAS extends the CSS import rule by enabling import of SCSS and SAS files. All imported files are merged into a single output. Its CSS file can virtually mix and match any file and be certain of all your styles at IMPORT takes a file name to import. 9. Why SAS is considered better than less? SAS allows you to write reusable methods and use logic statements, e. loops. In conditional SAS user can access Compass Library and use some awesome features like dynamic sprite map generation. Legacy browser hacks and cross-browser support for CSS3 features Compass also allows you to add an external framework like Blueprint Foundation or Bootstrap on top and less. You can write a basic logic statement using a guarded mixin, which is equivalent to SAS if statements in less. You can loop through numeric values using recursive functions while SAS allows you to iterate any kind of data in SAS. You can write your own handy functions. 10. Explain what is the use of mixin function in SAS. What is the meaning of drying out a mixin? Mixin allows you to define styles that can be reused throughout the style sheet without needing to resort to non-semantic classes like float left. Drying out of a mixing means splitting it into dynamic and static parts. The dynamic mixin is the one that the user actually going to call. 
and the static mixin is the pieces of information that would otherwise get duplicated. 11. Explain what SAS Maps is and what is the use of SAS Maps. SAS Map is a structured data in a hierarchical way and not just a bunch of variables. It can help in organizing the code. Some great use of Sasser it is very useful when dealing with layers of elements in your project it can be helpful in color management when there is long list of different color and shade use icon. Map for various social media icons for example. Facebook E607 or Twitter E602. Unlike other programming libraries, SAS Map will consist only of code that is going to be used. 12. Explain how SAS comments are different from regular CSS. Syntax for comments in regular CSS starts with asterisk comments while in SAS there are two type of comment, the single line comments and the multi-line CSS comments with asterisk. 13. Does SAS support inline comments? Single line comments will be removed by the SCSS preprocessor and won't appear in your .css file while the comment asterisk the valid CSS and will be preserved between the translation from SCSS to your .css file. 14. How interpolation is used in SAS in SAS, you can define an element in a variable and interpolate it inside the SAS code. It is useful when you keep your modules in separate files. 15. Explain when can you use the percent placeholders in SAS. Percent placeholders in SAS is useful when you want to write styles that were meant to be extended. But you don't want the base styles to be seen in output CSS styles. 16. Is it possible to nest variables within variables in SAS? Interpolation of variables names is not possible currently in SAS. However, you may use interpolation of placeholders. 17. Explain what is less. Less is dynamic style sheet producing language. Less is a CSS preprocessors and extends CSS with dynamic behavior. It allows for variables, mixins, operations, and functions. Less runs on server side and client side both. 18. Explain how to create less file and where to store it and compile it. Creating or storing less file is similar to creating, storing CSS file. A new less file can be created with a less extension or you can rename existing .css file to less file. You can write less code with existing CSS code. The best way of creating it inside tilde content or tilde styles folder. 19. What are SAS cons and pros? Pros. SAS is easy to learn especially for them who has a background of Python, Ruby or Kauf script in place using functions. Writing mix in CSS can easily convert it to SAS throughout the project. You don't have to repeat similar CSS statements using an extend attribute it allows to define variables that are usable throughout the entire project It keeps your responsive project more organized. Cons Requires time to learn new features of preprocessor before using you may not be able to use the built-in element inspector feature of the browser troubleshooting can be difficult. 20. In what ways less can be used? Via npm less can be used on the command line download as a script file for the browser for third-party tools it is used. 21. How variable is represented in less? Less allows variables to be defined. In less the variable is represented as it as ing. While variable assignment is done with a colon sing. The values of the variables are inserted into the CSS output file as well as minified file. 22. Explain how mixins is useful. Mixins enable embedding all the properties of a class into another class by including the class name as one of its properties. It is just like variables but for whole classes. 23. Explain how can set code in a watch mode when you run less.js in an HTML5 browser. If you run less.js in an HTML5 browser, it will use local storage to cache the generated CSS. However, 
From the developer point of view, they cannot see the changes they made instantly. In order to see your changes instantly, you can load program in development and watch mode by following JavaScript less than script type equals text JavaScript greater than less dot end equals development less watch less than script greater than 24 explain what is the meaning of nesting in lay programming nesting in less is clustering of statements inside other statements so it forms a group of related code in other words when we add a code snippet and add another code inside it then that code snippet is called nesting 25 explain what is data or in less in css Data URIs is one of the best technique. It allows developers to avoid external image referencing and instead embed them directly into a style sheet. Data URIs are the excellent way to reduce HTTP requests. 26. Mention what are the color channel functions used in less. Hue saturation HSV hue saturation HSW alu red green blue alpha luma luminance. 27. Explain what source map less inline. The source map less inline option indicates that we should include all of the CSS files into the source map, which means that you only need your map file to get to your original source. 28. Explain what is the use of extend all in less. When you specify all keyword last in an extend argument, it tells less to match that selector as part of another selector. 29. Explain what is strict imports in less. The strict imports controls whether the compiler will allow an add import inside of either or at media blocks or other selector blocks. 30. What are the similarities between less and sass? Between less and sass the similarities are namespaces, color functions, mixins and parametric mixins, nesting capabilities, JavaScript evaluations. List out the differences between less and SAS. Each style sheet language is good in their perspective and use, however, there are a few differences in their usage. Less less uses JavaScript and processed at client side variable names are prefaced with the at symbol less does not inherit multiple selectors with one set of properties less does not work with. Unknown units neither it returns syntax error notification for incompatible units or math related syntax error sass sass is coded in Ruby and thus processed to server side variable name R. Prefaced with dollar symbol sass inherits multiple selectors with one set of properties sass allows you to work with unknown units also returns a syntax error notification for incompatible units. 32. Explain what is the use of an combinator. An combinator concatenates nested selector with the parent selector. It is useful for pseudo classes such as hover and focus. 33. Explain what is the use of operations in less. Operations can be used for performing functions like simple mathematical operators plus asterisk. Color functions, math functions, any size or color variable can be operated upon. 34. Explain what is the use of escaping. The use of escaping unless when you need to output CSS that is not valid CSS syntax proprietary syntax not recognized by less less compiler will throw an error if not use simple prefix with tilde symbol and put in quotes. 35. What does less elements contains? Less elements contain commonly used mixins like gradient, rounded, opacity, dot box, shadow, inner shadow. 36. List out alternatives against less. SAS. Syntactically awesome style sheets as CSS version.2 of SAS stylus. 37. Explain how you can invoke the compiler from the command line. You can invoke the compiler from the command line in less as $LESSC styles less this will output the compiled CSS to STDO. You may then redirect it to a file of your choice $LESSC styles less greater than styles.css38 What is the use of E function? 
With the help of E-Function you can escape a value so that it passes straight through to the compiled CSS without being noticed by the less compiler. 39. Explain how you can pre-compile less into CSS? To pre-compile less into CSS you can use run less JS using Node.js. By using the Node.js JavaScript framework you can run the less JS script outside the browser use less PHP for the implementation of the less compiler written in PHP. Less PHP is used use online compiler use online compiler for quick compilation of less code without installing a compiler less. App for Mac users less.app is a free tool for Mac users. This tool auto compiles them into CSS files. 40. Explain how merge function is used in less. For aggregating values from multiple properties into a space or comma separated list under a single property, less is used. It is useful for properties such as transform and background. 41. How can you create a loop structures in less? A mixin can call itself in less. Such recursive mixins, when combined with pattern matching and guard expressions can be used to create various iterative loop structures. 42. Why do we need parametric mixins in less? Parametric mixins are same like standard mixins. The only difference is that parametric mixins take parameters like functions in JavaScript. After determining parameters to the mixins, you get more control over mixins. Cons white space sensitive no inline rules.